All right, I'm gonna go pick out a palette on my own today. Sarah's usually my good luck charm, so let's go see. These have gotta be the biggest palettes I've ever seen. <laughs> so I'm gonna go with one of these. These are 675 and they're huge. They're like nine feet tall probably. But I like this one because we got safety gate, nice little mirror toy, so like a good variety. This is the one, I'm feeling good about it. Might call Sarah and just see what she thinks, but I think that's our one. This one also has a pool pump on, which we sold one of those this year for a hundred bucks. So that's probably our one. I can't believe how big this thing is. It's ridiculous. All right, hopefully it doesn't fall over. All right, thank you, GRP. Behind us here is our biggest Amazon palette ever. We paid $675 for it, so let's open it up and see what's inside. Let's go. All right, how big is she? I think she's about nine feet tall. Whoa. Definitely our biggest palette ever. These are called Amazon Monsters and Mitch from GRP Liquidations just started getting these in again and they are awesome. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Uh, I'm gonna pass down some stuff from way up here. Okay. What is this? <laughs> I don't know, it's a pressure plate. It's to help, no, it's to help with your golf swing. Really? I think, that's cool. what it says. Oh yeah, pressure plate. Golf stuff is pricey. Yeah, So there you go. Christmas time is coming up. So now Thanks. that we're kind of getting into the holiday season, Stuff sells really well, or resells really well, I should say. Yep. We'll move a lot of this stuff on Facebook Marketplace. Ooh. Here's a non-stick pan. Axel. Yep, that's a good brand. Brand new. Not original packaging, though. Oh my. So here is a kid's water table. This is a little bit out of season. We might have to save it for next year or wait a while to sell it, but it'll definitely sell on Facebook Marketplace. What do we have here? This looks like a dog carrying bag, you think? Carry your pet. There you go. I sell dog stuff, cat stuff, all the time on Marketplace. That's a big one. Easy to sell all day long. This is like a little stick vacuum, battery powered. That'll I sell. I sell a lot of vacuums also. Brand new. So like five or 10 bucks. You'd yeah. Five or 10 bucks. Yep. Oh man. What is that? I don't know. Uh. It's kind of a tripod. Something. I don't see any instructions with this, but it's a tripod. Pad of sorts, I think. Interesting, is that wallpaper? Wallpaper! Some green wallpaper, <laughs> partially used. It is? Yeah. Oh shoot. Yeah. Some of this stuff cannot be resold, but there is a lot of stuff that can be resold. So since we paid $6.75 for this pallet, we'll break even at about $13.50 in MSRP. As long as we have $13.50 MSRP, we can make a profit on this pallet. So we get all our pallets from GRP Liquidations. It is our favorite pallet place. If you're in the area, we highly recommend going to see our friend Mitch. He's Tons awesome. Tons of different options and yeah. the monsters right now, which are super fun, so. So much fun. Here's a pillow. I cannot sell this really without packaging on it, but definitely a good donation to like homeless shelters. Even like dog shelters use this kind of stuff, so. As long as it, yeah, appears clean, which that one yeah, does. Yeah, it yep. does. Yep. yep. Oops, I think I cut the bag on that one. Oh, Benjamin. Did I? Good donation to like homeless shelters. Oops, cut the bag, but this looks like <laughs> whatever it is I cut. Oops. Oh my goodness. It's like a one person tent. That's why they say don't use the razor. <laughs> well, I didn't, it was like crushed. That's Looks like good. it's in good shape, so. Just the, um, just the bag. Just the bag. <laughs> so, there's a tent for you. All right. Oh, is this an air mattress? Don't recognize that brand. And it looks like maybe it's been blown up. So we'll probably have to blow it up to see, make sure it doesn't have leaks, but I can probably get 40 bucks for that. So this package, is one of the reasons I picked the pallet. Oh yeah? We usually like to try to pick pallets so that we can see one or two more expensive items that will pay for at least half the pallet. So this is a pool pump. Nice. Two and a half horse, which last summer we got one that was one and a half horse and it, we sold it for like a hundred bucks. So yeah. I'm gonna look this up, but we may have to keep this until next summer. Yeah. Which that's what we did at our last pool pump too, so. A lot of people got a ton of Christmas trees on their pallets last January and now all of a sudden they're like selling them like crazy for like really good profit, but they had to hang on to them for like almost a year. Oh, <laughs> this is the bottom of an office chair. Okay, wait, I looked at my pool pump. Okay. It's $200. All right. So we sell it for 100. There you yeah. go. That's Six cool. of our pallet right there. This is the bottom of an office chair, so we'll see if we get the top of it somewhere in the pallet. I don't know. Maybe you can just buy 
Maybe on like a base? replacement yeah, part maybe. if yours broke. Okay, you wanna hand me a razor? Yep. Oh boy, this oh. is gonna take us a while, I think. Oh, Look snap. Look at all the packages. That's, That's why they call them monsters. Yep. Home fitness, I see. What's this? <laughs> you what? know what that is? <laughs> Something for your spine, maybe? Oh. Home yeah, fitness? I don't know. You roll on it? You guys in the comments usually know. What, what is, is this? this? Please tell us. What is this? A game? Ooh. Ooh, is it oh, fetch I know what for this a is. doggy? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's like a fetch game, auto fetch for the dogs. They if put you want to just sit there and it shoots sip them. in your yeah. margarita. <laughs> Sweet. Nice. There you go. That's a good find. Love it. <laughs> okay, what do we have? <gasps> what is it? Sweet. It's Extreme, like a worker helmet. But it's like a safari hat. <laughs> yeah, safari worker helmet. Why is it like that? That's cool. It's probably worth more than you think. You like it, huh? I love it. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Your head's too big. I do have a very large head. Jamie's got a giant head. <laughs> Another tent. Tent of sorts. We got quite a few tents in our garage right now. It doesn't look like it has any poles though. Well, maybe it's like a tarp. Doesn't it look like a top mm. tarp? Yeah, like Might the rain be. fly. It's a suspicious return if you ask me. Yeah. A lot of people have been not very honest with their returns lately, I have noticed. Uh, that feels like a good one. Yeah? Yep. You want like me to it. open it? Yep. All right. Ooh, okay. Oh, cute. See, I knew it. <laughs> knew it's like a it. canister set with little spoons. And there's four of them in here. And they don't look broken. Cute. You can sell that on Marketplace all day long. So if you guys have been watching for a while, you know that we have a secret side hustle we've been keeping under wraps, but we just revealed it. So if you're interested in finding out more about that, we will link it below but it involves our pallet business in reviewing items. Yeah, so. basically, even if we break even on this pallet, we're still happy because we get to review the items, turn it into passive income. It's, it's pretty incredible, so. Four to $6,000 a month we're making passively by reviewing these items. So if you're interested in that course, check it out below. Really believe in it, and it's something we're really excited about. Ooh, this is a fancy, a very fancy shower head. Look at this. Ooh, a rain shower rain head. head. It looks used. Really? Yep. Did someone return their old rain shower head? No, it, it, no, you'd be able to tell if it was okay. used a lot. Maybe they hooked it up and didn't like how it looked, so. Ooh, cute. A little gray tea kettle. Let's see if that's what's inside here. But this one's what's inside. I don't know anything about that brand, Chantel, but it looks really nice and feels pretty quality. Oh, unbroken glassware. Shade. No, it's shades for like a lamp. Oh yeah. Maybe Which, the rest of the lamp those, is... those are pretty generic, but yeah, those are like for your esconce, yeah. Esconce. Yeah. Yes. It's heavy. Luxury air bed, it says. It's pretty heavy. Unopened. You can tell it's never been out of package because it still fits in the box. Yes. <laughs> Perfectly. So that's a good one. So most of these items from Monsters, we end up selling locally on Facebook Marketplace because they tend to be bigger. If it's over a $50 item, we, we sometimes list them on eBay, but mm -hmm. uh, sometimes it's easier just to list them on Facebook Marketplace. We do porch pickup, so it's not a lot of face-to-face -face time. It's pretty easy communication. Okay, so this item here looks unopened. It looks like a, like a tray you would have at a restaurant to set like your, when you're clearing dishes. No, no, no. No? That's a suitcase tray. <laughs> What's that? that? Like, you know, in hotels, that's where you like set your suitcase on, right? The Motel 6? <laughs> I don't oh, know. Yeah. Maybe we're both wrong. This is some sort of thing that goes, ah, worm. Blah. Look at that, it looks like a stick. Oh, inchworm. So there's some other parts in here. It looks like this is like a slide out of a drawer in a cabinet. I've had trouble selling those a little bit in the past. I don't know why, I think because it's a very niche thing. You need the specific drawer, but I'll do my best. And if you're wondering why we're opening our pallet in the woods, it's because our neighbor's having a septic tank replaced. Shout out, Joe. Uh, hey, guys. So it's a little quieter back here, but yep. it's also very scenic. That's Perfect true. for fall time. It's beautiful. Ooh, some bedding, I think. Yep. Not in packaging, oh, yeah. but they included the package, so I could maybe... Stuff it in there. Stuff it in there, Can but you? cute little bedding set. This looks kind of more expensive. It's like a hose reel system. Huh. Guess what? how much this costs? A hose reel. Found it. $120. Normally $229. What? On sale for $167. What? It's like the fancy one. We'll show a picture on the screen. 
Ah. But also, right before Prime Day, if you guys want to know the secret, they mark up their prices and then mark them down for Prime Day. They so, sure do. So it's still 165 bucks. Yep. Brand new. We got some sort of a bath mat here. A good garage sale guy. Aw, look at this little guitar. Cute. Tiny little ukulele guy or something. Little guitar. This stuff. Hey, that's a good one. Is ridiculously expensive as well. It's like a knee walker if you hurt your ankle. Yeah. I'll have to sell this one on eBay though because Facebook Marketplace will always flag me for medical equipment. Oh. Anytime I list stuff like this. That is tricky. Unless you have like your own private Facebook group or you put it in like a garage sale group. Looks like, yeah, hundred bucks for that. So there you go. it's adding up quick. Yeah, it's adding up very this quick. is a good one. Definitely gonna make some money on this one. For sure. Another tent. New though. We got ourselves a tent. A little two guy maybe. This is a lot of seasonal stuff, but that's okay because we can either hang on to it or sell it for a little bit cheaper. But in Michigan, it's still like camping season. So I'm going to get that listed right away. What is Ooh. this? All right, guys, we got something strange here. It's like crushed up seashells. What? Oh, I feel like it's going to spill everywhere. A whole bag of like... What? What is that for? Lightweight like a fish tank or something. Oh. Okay. That looks like an RV step or something, right? How did what you is... know that? No, it's not. It's for a ladder. But that was pretty close. Good guess. Let me see. Better, oh, or it's for heavy. Like paint. Yeah, or it's just an extra step on your ladder. Okay. Or something. Interesting. I don't know. Baby gate. These always sell well, although you definitely have to sell these in our area at least for under 50% retail. Yep. Because baby stuff's everywhere. So at least a $20 bill there. At right, least, yeah. Yep. Yeah, 20 or 30. This looks like another baby gate. Yeah. I'm gonna scan to make sure. What do we have here? Something uh, leather, some sort of cover for your grill, I bet. Perfect time of year for I that. Need that or air conditioner cover, maybe? Oh, a bunch of them. One, two. Oh, for your tires, for your camper. Yeah, you're supposed to do that apparently. So otherwise, really? they crack and dry out. Yep. Yep. Another baby gate here. This one is very well sold on Amazon for 70 bucks. So yeah, we'll definitely get 20 or 30 for it. Yeah. Keyboard tray. So this is like, if you have a, still have a keyboard? I have a keyboard. Yeah, okay. Come on. For, <laughs> you still have a desk? You put your keyboard tray on there. All right, this is one I saw. You did? I tried to not break it with my toe straps. Oh, let's see if it's broken. It's pretty stylish, it's a mirror. Has curved. Apparently, curves are very in right now. Yep. Here, should I just shake it? Well, it doesn't, doesn't sound, sound broken. broken. Usually, you can tell. I'm still doubtful though. Let's let's, let's make check sure. Let's it out. Oh, it's well packaged. So maybe. Right, big money. Hey. Hey. Cool. Let's show them. That's nice. Unbroken. Big mirror. We never too. get an unbroken mirror. Yeah. That never happens to us. 16 by 20 oak wood picture frame. See if this guy's broken. That's nice. Oh, it's like a picture. That's a pretty good print, actually. Yeah, that's yeah. nice. Comforter and pillow shams. It's a silky one. Other pallet flipping people on our channel. You guys have any other ideas for us besides donate on the uh, used bedding? We're open to hear it. All right, we got a tray for a, some fridge, I think, right? A drawer? Remember on our last pal, we, we thought that was the I Electrolux. Know. All right, where was the Electrolux? Oh, no. Did we open it already? Yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, sad. Oh, no. But this one's not broken, so. Also, I need someone to explain these to me. This is like a cooling fan. I think you put like ice in it. Yes. The AC Let's ice see, coolers. I mean, first of all, do they really work? Second of all, they're still not that cheap. Right. Like so you may like, as well just buy an air conditioner. It's like halfway between a fan and a... Yeah, explain that to me, please. This is all busted up too and used. Oh no. At least the feet are missing out. What? See, someone totally used that for the summer and then returned it. Oh yeah. You maybe, think? Maybe that's it. Or maybe they didn't like how it worked. But yeah, that's kind of dirty. This is weird. Plastic jars. Oh yeah, candy little station. Maybe for a wedding, you have like a yep. little candy That's setup. What it is. Looks like I got some sort of a plant here. Two tall like planter guys though. <gasps> Those are cute. Come on. I feel like we have a big pile in our garage of planters <laughs> that are not used. So. I love planters. <laughs> why okay. do we keep getting this rug? <laughs> this rug we've gotten so many times. I know why. It's because it kind of sucks. 
It's kind of... We we had an orange one, the first one we ever had, and it got orange fur everywhere. Well, you were like, oh, I'll put that in my office. And I put it on the cement floor in our basement, and it glued itself yeah. to the floor. Well, and the picture on Amazon is like, oh, that's so fluffy and nice. And then in person, it's like, what is Pretty this? Pretty chintzy. Piece so, of junk, yeah. Don't buy this if you're considering... <laughs> yeah! Zero Amazon. stars. Zero stars, yes. Car window shade for the babies, for the dogs. This is interesting, LED fill light. Camera equipment, like lighting it looks like, fill light for photo oh, cool. video. So nice. use that for the podcast. Yeah. Rear left driver's side. Power window replacement. Okay. On pallets, you tend to get a lot of car parts and I think some people do really well with it. I just struggle because it's like, I don't feel confident that this even works or what car it goes to half the time. But this is like a window replacement. I'm gonna open this one because it's sweet. Is this it the one Grandpa? we can sell. It's Grandpa's Weeder. <gasps> you did love oh. this one. This tool right here is a beast. So basically, you shove that over your plant and then you step on it and it, it pinches it out of the ground. Works. It actually works. We have tons of those pokey things in our the yard. Giant ones, and it was like whoop. rips them right out. So yep. that's like a $40 tool, but totally worth it. Carpet chair mats. Crazy mats. Yeah, I wanna see that What's actually. That? Crazy it is. <laughs> Oh, it's just one of these. These are from like the 90s. Did your parents have one of these? Yeah, for if you have a rolling desk on carpet. Yeet. Raise your hand in the comments if your parents had one of these under an office chair in your like computer room growing up. Everybody did. Oh, this is pretty sweet. Whoa, what's that? Like a engine tinker toy for a kid so they can work on the engine. <gasps> what? Has like all these cool parts. Cute. This kind of stuff is sweet. What do they call it? STEM learning? Yes. Experiential learning? That's sweet. Our daughters would love this, but we also are having a boy this January. Yep. So, but this kind of stuff for resale it. too around Christmas time. Yeah. Perfect. So, that's cool. Awesome. Ruby would love that. Here's another one of those roll out cabinet drawers. Little window boxes. Aw, kind of cute. It looks like there's three or four in here. So, those are nice. Yeah, those are super nice. Well, I think we've gotten this one before too. Really? Hike Encher self inflating mattress. Yeah. It's actually a really expensive mattress. Um, self inflating, so it's like super plush for when you're yeah. hiking, but I think it's like a, over $100. We really? reviewed that. So a lot of this stuff seems pretty obscure, but people go to Amazon to buy obscure products. And so mm -hmm. if you can make a review for the item and then sell it, yeah. double win. Whoa, that What's is that? a fancy fan. I don't know, it's just a cool fan. Let's look that up. Looks like a salon fan or something, <laughs> you know? All right, we got another luxury air bed here. So I'm seeing a theme, I kind of like it. Amazon also has a picture search if your barcode doesn't work in the scanner. Oh yeah, it's an outdoor cordless fan for camping. Oh, cool. $120. What? Yeah, look. No way. This looks like a white comforter. Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh. Need some stairs to get up here. Yeah. Trekking poles for hiking. Are those expensive? Whoa. Yep. Those look pretty fancy. So these are like hiking poles, trekking, lots of outdoor stuff. Yeah. I like it. This, I believe, is like a body pillow for like pregnancy or for nursing, things like that. This says rice dispenser storage. So this looks new in box. So it's a rice dispenser? Yeah, like you hold your giant bag of rice, okay. and then you just pull okay. it out when you need it. Wow, this has small parts in it, and I think oh. I know what it is. The little hammer it comes with. You build your own storage, and that actually is more expensive than you think too. It's, it's like 80 and 100 bucks, isn't it? Those are great, it depends how big they are, but yeah. Yeah, we'll look that up and show you, but a lot of $100 items on yeah. this. Yeah, this has been a pretty good one so far. Another air mattress, we're gonna have to have an air mattress blowing up party. day yeah. to yeah. see if these all work. But especially. if they do, they are good items to sell. Yeah, so for sure. Some kind of bedding. Okay. Yeah, I'm noticing a lot of these items, you know, there's nothing like stand out wow, like wow items. Yeah. You know, except for maybe the pool pump is a $200 item, but there's so many items. You're really, I mean, I'm sure our MSRP is really crazy, really high. crazy right now. So four piece white picket fence. Ooh, these ones are usually a disappointment. This is like your U-Haul box. <laughs> Yeah. Right. And so people like don't have the original box or whatever yeah. they're shipping back. It's usually bedding. It's another one of those rugs. What? Look, it's just shrink wrapped still. So. It's purple. Is it purple? Oh no, it's like black and white. Black and white. It's the same rug but just a different color. This 
Looks like women's products. Yep, just donate these, but they are. Well, that one. That one's open, open but stuff. the rest of them aren't. Just like women products. Good to donate. That stuff's expensive too, yeah, so yeah. it is good to donate. Very glamorous ceiling light, I think wow. this is. Light fixtures are ridiculously expensive, so. That's what it looks like, yeah, it's like a. I bet looks like, like a sunflower. Yeah, hundred. Yeah, over hundred dollars for sure. I can never quite get fifty percent MSRP for those for some reason. Yeah, but. Can you get like forty bucks for me? Maybe. Yeah. If I find the right buyer, I might have to sit on it for a while. Sarah is the reselling queen, by the way. If you don't know, she's the one who does most of the reselling. I do. It's true. We're getting towards the I think the you might like that one. You, you always, for some reason, like this. I do. It's an ice maker, but Jamie doesn't realize this, but there's a specific ice maker I'm looking for that creates nugget ice. No, what she, what the ridiculous thing is, hold on. We have a refrigerator that makes two different kinds of ice. But it's not like it's the not melts in your mouth, crunchy like no, ice. No, that's... It is. There's small ice cubes and big ice cubes. That's you don't know what I'm talking about? Like the gas I station do. ice cubes? I They're do. just like slushy feeling. Oh, so good. What's this? What do you got? Oh my. Headlight for? Oh, for a golf cart. A golf cart. Okay. There you go. We live in Michigan, so that seems random, but lots of people in the South have golf very fancy city. golf carts. Yep. This, I have sold so many of these now all different types these like outdoor wagons or yeah. like baby wagons stuff like that I don't know why but these are such a good marketplace seller I can usually get like 60 or 70 percent of retail value for these so and that's probably like 80 to 100 dollar thing right at least yeah sometimes more the kid ones sometimes can be like hundreds there you go I got it 90 bucks there you go oh, oh my. no way is that the rug again I don't know it is look at that you it's can tell the pink the one it's the pink one with that same pattern. Oh the my rubber black. goodness. These rugs stink. People Good. open it up and they're like, what is this piece of junk? For college dorm room, maybe. I guess. I mean, that's like, one of those things where you can maybe, I mean, get 10, maybe. maybe $20 for it, but. LED fan light. Oh, these are cool actually. So then you don't have to have like a massive fan. Oh yeah, those are getting popular. Yeah. Oh. No way. Another one. What color is that this one? This one's like a beige. A blush. Blush? I'll title it as blush. Blush. <laughs> it's all about the title. The marketing of it? The marketing, oh, yep. Wait, something else is in here. Price. Oh! Whoa! Also an Amazon smart thermostat randomly showed in this box. There's one more. Final item. Patio umbrella base. Oh, heavy guy. Very heavy. Successful palette for very, sure. Very successful. That was a good one. Remember we paid $675. We needed a $1350. MSRP to break even. Yep. I'm sure we're way above that. Definitely. Plus we have a hundred items here to, to review. review. For yes. Amazon. So yep. very successful. So thanks for watching guys. We have an entire playlist on flipping pallets and we also resell other stuff on our channel and we'll put those playlists below. So go check them out. We'll see you next time. Thanks guys. Bye. Bye.